Get another game, another career high in points for you. I mean, you were saying yesterday how confident you were coming into this. What's it mean to come away with another signature win and really a blowout over a really good team? Yeah, it means a lot. It just shows that hard work pays off. And, you know, our team works really hard every single day. We don't take days off here. You know, we're going to be right back into the gym tomorrow. So, um, yeah, we just work hard. We're all confident in each other. We play selfless basketball. We don't care who scores. And we just want to win. So that's what got us the dub tonight. You guys got a big momentum swing when you checked back in in the first half. After you sat down for that foul, was there anything your coaches told you or a teammate told you that kind of, you know, got you ready to come back and help spark you guys that big 17-2 run? Yeah, I mean, I'm just always ready every single, you know, I made that foul and it was kind of a mistake. So I was like, as soon as I get back in, I need to, you know, make some plays, be aggressive, get back into the group of the game. And, you know, my confidence never wavers no matter what. So at any time, I can, anyone on the team can make plays. You start to feel it a little bit more with your jumper and getting a little more confidence there? Yeah, I feel like it's improving every single day. Coach Beeline's done a great job with uh, improving the mechanics in my shot, and I'm just, I'm super confident in my shot right now. You were matched up with Lil for you know, a chunk of the game. How did you approach that matchup? What did you think of him? Uh, it was a big matchup for me. I played in, in high school before, and you know I took that matchup as a personal one for me. So. I just wanted to be the best player on the court and play the best game I could play, and then you know the entire team just played amazing. You said that the first exhibition, you were surprised at how many people were here. Just talking about the crowd today. Is oh man, expect. I loved it. I loved it. I mean, I didn't. I expected a big crowd, but when everyone started yelling and screaming, like my emotions are so high. It just there's not a better feeling in the world. Well, can you feel them feeding off you? And, and you feed off them? Yeah, I feel like it goes both ways. The crowd. I love the crowd here. I love everyone in Ann Arbor. It's just such a, you know, home feeling, and I feel like everyone's supporting us, and I just love it. How many emotions when this one's over? Walking off the court. It, it just felt really good, but we can't, you know, dwell on this victory. This this is just a, a November win for us, and uh, um, you know, it's it's only the beginning. It's a big mark for us. It shows us where we're at, but we need to continue to improve and. Are you sure you weren't here before? <laughs> you know, it's yeah. like a freshman. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I feel prepared for this moment. Okay. Iggy, back to that 17-2 run. I mean, you mentioned you wanted to get back in. What did you feel like the team did differently? We just, you know, we just started to hit shots, started to make plays. I feel like early on we're kind of missing, like, shots that we usually make. We're missing free throws. So um, I feel like when I got back in, I made a couple plays, and then everything just started rolling from there.